Alan Harwell with your Chris 6 Sports Report. Hi, good evening everybody. The Flower Bluff Lady Hornets are hoping to make a return trip to the state tournament this year. And by all accounts so far, they definitely look the part. All right, we got some video for you. In fact, they really look good in uh, rank number 12 in the state in Class 5A. And tonight they were in search of their 24th win of the season at Carroll. The Lady Tigers pull the big upset. Well, here we go now. The Lady Hornets relentless on defense. Look at Jade Schritter steals the ball right here. Going to get it to Meredith Markham. And Markham's then going to toss it back to Schritter, who nails the three. She had eight points tonight. Haley Campbell getting it done also tonight for the Lady Hornets. Look at her here. Nice feed pass here to Sierra Bauckham. Now the Lady Hornets were up 24 late in this game. Look at how smooth their transition game is. Campbell to Markham with the easy lay-in. She scored a team high 11 this evening. Flower Bluff goes on to win by 26. 60 to 34, so they get their 24, 24th win of the year. And once again, this is a powerhouse program. I asked Coach James McMahon tonight, what's the key to their success? Uh, you know, great families, kids that donate a lot of time in the summer and their own time to, to work on their skill and understand the game. And they play 40, 50 games in the summer to, to, get, to get better. So, you know, in the offseason, they, they do a great job of making themselves a better player so that way when we come back and put the parts together in the in the season we have more options i think uh, over the season we've just gotten more comfortable with each other we move the ball well and we're becoming more patient which is really helping our offense uh yes i definitely think that this is could be the same team that could get up there maybe win two more games and get what we really wanted from last year i feel really good i think we're a way better team i mean we get along so well which it makes it better on the court all right, they're going to be tough to beat after the break. Juan will join us for a final look at the forecast right after this.